Probably never, right? <laughs> I mean, almost never, <laughs> if you ask them, right? So what's been the reaction of Peripheral? Well, the, the viewing audience has loved it. I mean, it's overwhelming. We, uh, we're we number one on Amazon, so that's always a good sign. Um, don't ask me about reviews, I don't read them, so, but, you know, I, I much prefer knowing what, uh, what the audience thinks you, about it. You play Chloe's dad? No, oh, who, 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 you're getting me mixed up with the Westworld. I played Dolores' dad in Westworld. Oh, okay. But I play, no, I'm definitely not her dad. I'm not, I'm not a nice guy. I, oh, okay. I sort of own the town that she, oh, okay, that okay. she uh, lives in. It wasn't me as a publicist. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why? Come on. I'm going to call, okay. Damn. No, because we did the junket, but uh, I didn't see the movie or anything, and we, oh, didn't, right. we didn't get the red carpet, so I'm oh, limited okay. information. I'm but uh, tell me what it's about. What is Peripheral about? Okay. Well, first of all, it's based on a William Gibson novel by the same name. It takes place in two timelines, uh, basically 2030, which is about you know eight to ten years ahead of us, and then in the year 2100 in London. Uh, what happens in Clanton, North Carolina, fictitious town, uh, where Chloe and Jack Rayner, uh, Burton and Flynn Fisher, they're gamers, and they play these video virtual reality video games for corporations. That's how they make their money. And then they get a hold of one, a brand new one, that's sort of very different. It sends their consciousness into the 22nd century, really. So the year 2100. Got it. And so, yeah. Okay. It's, uh, and Sounds then cool. all hell breaks loose. Okay. I can't, is it weird that you, you know, you cast on a show and, you know, you don't know what to think of it, and it's the number one show on Amazon? Well, it... Well, first of all, it's Jonah, Jonah Nolan and Lisa Joy who brought us Westworld, and so I think that you know people turn out for that. They're good know? at and putting so, out good stuff. Well, they're they're, they're known for it, right. and 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 anything they do is going to be epic. And so, you know, plus you know it's it's straight up sci-fi. William Gibson has a huge following too, so yeah. it's sort of a built-in you know uh, marketplace. And then once they come, they're always pleased with what they see so you know well, well now i'm gonna watch it please do okay all right watch it too thank I'm gonna, you i'm gonna wish i asked different questions or something after i see it right <laughs> yeah, yeah well no those were good questions okay that's about all i could tell you okay. anyway. sounds so, good right. great talking to you thank you take care